So Gvaruch Kamonim Motai, as Pesach gets even closer, uh, many people will start going shopping to buy the necessary uh, food needs for, for the holiday. So it's very important, especially in nowadays, that a person purchases food with for Pesach food and drinks that have a proper hashgacha, a respectable hashgacha for Pesach. Baruch Hashem, we live in a generation where you know everything is available to us with uh, very good hashgachot. So a person should not skimp on Pesach, and the person should take the hashgacha, the most respected, most mahudan hashgacha that he can find. A person should not assume, even though it is true, not everything needs hashgacha le Pesach. But don't assume that oh, it looks innocent enough. There's probably not chametz. You shouldn't assume anything because, especially the way foods are produced today, there's so many ingredients, so many production lines, and things like that. There could be chametz <coughs> lurking in many different places that you wouldn't even know. So unless you consult with a, uh, a list or a talmid chacham who's baki in these dinim of kashrut and the production methods for these uh, for these products, a person shouldn't assume that it's free of chametz. Now, in terms of using lists. There are lists made by very respected kashrut agencies, such as the OU, Star K, the CRC, among others, that speak about things, there are products that have a regular year-round hashgacha, and it doesn't need a special Pesach hashgacha, it's fine as is. If the hashgacha itself is telling you that, that's okay, because they are privy to that information, they know what goes into the, to the production. So those are the lists that we, again, uh, that we recommend in general, but sometimes there are more private lists that say that this is okay and that's okay without a Pesach Hashgacha. If it's not a list directly from a reputable Kashrut uh, agency, uh, I would not recommend using it for Pesach. And like we said, there are <clears throat> many options uh, to choose from in the, with regards to the lists and with regards to things that have a proper Hashgacha Pesach. So there's no reason to cut corners. Yom Tov. Have a wonderful day.